What is up, YouTube? Pink Reaper here, back with more Let's Play Hippopotamus 64. Um, so in the last part, which has been a while, uh, <laughs> I don't even remember what I did. I got the shining laser. I know that much because I needed to get um, I needed to get enough money to upgrade it. Which, oh my god, it was way more than I thought it was going to be. It was going to be I thought it was going to be like five hundred thousand. It was actually like seven hundred and fifty thousand. Um, so it took quite a bit of time. Uh, I was at like 6 hours and 50 minutes when I started, uh, and now I'm at almost 8.45, so it took almost 2 hours to get all the money I needed for uh, for the gun. But it is completely upgraded now. Uh, if you want to see what that looks like, uh, allow me to murder these two enemies. Uh, hold on. Okay, we're done. <laughs> That's what the shiny laser looks like. That's what the shiny laser does. Um, so it's just, it's just a laser that comes out of your arm and just murders everything. Uh, it goes through enemies and can hit other enemies. Uh, you cannot use it while moving. You have to be standing completely still to use it. So there's that. Um, from this point on, the game is easy mode. <laughs> um, this thing just, this gun just absolutely wrecks everything. But uh, I did want to have it very badly so that I could fight the next boss. The next boss was one I, did, one I didn't really want to bother, like, bother with. Um, as you can see here, I have not bought the Kevlar jacket, though. Um, 120 grand more added on to the 750 I already could get. I was just like, ugh, I don't even care. Um, not even worth it for me. Um, the other thing is, I, uh, I adjusted my mic settings. I did not realize this, but at some point or another, my mic started operating at 60%. Um, it was only, well, 59% it was recording it for some reason. I don't really know why. Um, take that dog. But that just started happening. So you should be able to hear me a little more clearly now. Um, but it's going to make me sound a lot louder. I don't know if it's going to be too loud. Um, I, I upped the, uh, the game audio just a little bit too, only like 3 or 4%, uh, just to sort of let you hear it a little better over me screaming at you now. Anyway, we gotta come down here. Gotta murder this thing. These things are annoying because they they can only take so much damage before they, like, it's a set amount of damage these things take. It always takes three cycles to kill them no matter what, so the laser's not really any more useful. We'll just... Whatever, I'm just gonna ignore you. I don't really need to kill anything right now. Oh, also, for anyone paying attention, I did that wrong just a little while ago, where I, I refilled my canteen and then I, I bought another uh, energy pack for it. Um, it would have been more, If you buy an energy pack for it, it just instantly refills it anyway, so... Ooh, let's go fight that dog thing. How's it going, bro? Not so tough now, are ya? Anyways, so as of right now, we have three gate or two of the three gate keys. We need to get the third one. Um, and if I remember where I'm going, which I might not, I'm gonna be completely honest. It's entirely possible I forgot where I'm going right now. This should take me to where I need to go. Now, hmm. Let's see what's in here, shall we? I 
I thought you did die. I was trying to kill you. Me. I'm hungry. Hurry up, get on board. It's time to activate Bruno. His name's Bruno. This robot is my masterpiece. You're welcome to try and stop us, but you won't stand a chance. You know, I have two guns equipped to my arms right now, and you're not in the robot, right? By the way, this boss is a huge bag of dicks. Just gonna throw that out there right now. This is probably the most annoying boss in the entire game to fight. Uh, which is why I wanted the shining laser completely upgraded before I fought it. Because uh, I don't want to fight it the normal way. Uh, it's uh, It loves to spam those green homing orbs. Damn, you big boy. Yeah, kind of like that. So, okay, good, it already happened. The only thing I wanted to have happen in this battle is that he destroys part of this cage. Or not part of this cage, but part of this, uh... And... You're dead. Part of this fence. Because it makes it easier if I ever want to come back into the, um, the subsidy. And it makes it easier to get into the main gate. Hippopotamus. Mega Man Bulma. Mega Man? You know, I've been in this business a long time. But this is the first time anyone's ever given me this much trouble. Yet, the history of how we treat life like this. Almost as though I've met my match. So. I can face the fact I lost to you once. I'm going to try to be an entire idiot. What blue sky, bro? Have you looked up into the sky? That is not blue. Also, are you aware your brother is a robot? Bond th family theme song. I love the Bond th family theme song. Alright. This is the other big reason that I wanted it destroyed. After the boss battle, it starts you outside of here, so if none of the fence is destroyed, you have to go back into the main gate uh, to get to this. Uh, for the record, that boss battle super difficult without the the shine laser, and he can he can destroy these buildings, and they stay destroyed forever. Um, so I decided to kill him and not let him do any of that. Go away, dog. No one cares. Anyway, we come down here, or not, Where's the fucking entrance? Okay. Thank God everything's super dark, so I can't tell. It's more of the same stuff we've already seen. Um, 
it's like the first main or sub gate I went into. Um, sub city, I'm sorry. Uh, you just kill all the enemies, and the door opens. Uh, no special boss or anything like that. Just more of the same. This one actually has some easier enemies in it. It has like these guys instead of the like really annoying like drill arm dudes. What? Not really not. There we go. Oh, okay, I can do that. It's just... I must not have been pressing the right buttons to do it. Okay. That is really awkward. You have to press C left and C right to aim this thing. It's not... Um... I was trying to do it earlier, and I'm like, does, does it just not work? I guess I wasn't pressing the buttons correctly. You're dead. This enemy makes it mandatory to have the jump shoes. Wait, I can hear you. Oh, you're right there. I think I just saw you and I just... Huh? Like a door somewhere. I better take a look around. Um, one of the other things I don't think I mentioned is that these buildings down here are also destroyable. Destructible. Destructive babble. Um, they can be destroyed. Uh, only by the machine gun fire of those, like, four-legged enemies, though. Um, it happened quite a bit while I was grinding. There. This should be the last key. Now all I have to do is open the central gate. That is, in fact, the last thing we have to do. But it is not the last thing we're going to do. So, after the last instance of you seeing the Bond family, I believe, uh, there's one more scene where we see them, but this is like our actual last confrontation with them. Well, let's go see that scene anyway. Let's just... Let's make sure I don't have to come back here and do this again, so... Shut up, dogs. If we head back down this way... You're alive again. Free money for me, I guess. I'm actually getting kind of close. Um, not kind of close, but I mean, I'm starting to get enough money that I could maybe get the Kevlar jacket Omega. Not that I'm going to need it. Not a lot of things are going to be able to live long enough to hit me. Oh, Okay, that was stupid of me. Not really, I'm feeling like dealing with you guys right now. So now that we have the three keys, we can open up three doors. What do you think, jackass? It's the last key you have. What's happening to me? This is the first time I've ever been here, but I feel like I've seen this before. Something is telling me there's danger here, that it shouldn't be opened. And why are you opening it, asshole? It's a man? A person? Pay special attention to that line.
was it you who woke me? It is somewhat earlier than I had planned, but no matter. Thank you for awakening me. Hmm. Have we met before? So, please forgive me. You are a purifier model, assigned to the direct command of Mother, as I recall, who had designated Mega Man Trigger. Please forgive me. I did not recognize you in this current configuration. You... You know me? You don't remember? Ah, I see. You have suffered from me once, yes? Then for what purpose have you awakened me? I assume... But your reason for coming here is to purge the carvings that have over propagated during the time I was there. Carvings? Purge? What are you talking about? According to Urban Military Security Ordinance, a new zero, the number of carving units is not allowed to increase beyond the pre-specified limit. If this happens, they are to be purged immediately. My observation is left unattended. The carvings will be produced indefinitely. The numbers will grow. The living is perfectly. They can be quite amazing. Carvings? Do you mean the people on the island? The carvings with mass population model C. They are unstable. Very difficult to control. Perhaps it would be better to simply reinitialize. Reinitialize? So I haven't understood much of what you've been saying, but when you say reinitialize, do you mean no? Huh? This is quite the purpose. It would be much simpler if I had the assistance of a proficient team, such as yourself. Once my task is complete, I shall inquire as to the presence of a backup ceremony on Eden. Until then, please remain where you are. Yes, until then. What? Is that? Shoutouts to Mega Man Juno. Wait for it. They used Mega Man's voice clip right there. <laughs> Why, why does that happen? How does that happen? Why does everyone keep getting my name wrong? My name is Hippopotamus. Right. It's not over between you and me. I won't forgive you if you die or anything stupid like that. So be careful in there, okay? Right. Oh yeah. She wants the D. Don't worry, Trot. If anyone can do it, he can. I know. Oh, what the fuck? No. No, 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 no. Don't shoot, don't shoot me, bro. Alright, we're gonna leave now. Because, uh... That's what a real hero would do, right? Just, just leave right after the evil robot talked about eliminating all the carbons. A.K.A. people. Okay, so... If you couldn't hear what he said... Um... Which wouldn't be surprising, because again, the audio mixing in this game is kind of fucking terrible. Um, uh, that was Mega Man Juno. He says, we are a purifier model, designation Mega Man Trigger. And that, uh, the number of carbons on the planet has, uh, breached the recommended amount, let's put it like that, the, the designated amount, and as such, the planet is, he's going to purify the planet of carbons, 
That means people. He's gonna kill all the people. So we have to stop that, but not right now. First, we have to go back to the flutter and uh, and do something. So up we go. I missed that jump horribly. So, apparently the bank has been robbed. Apparently. So, if we go back to town. I'm going the long way on purpose. What's funny is I don't think anyone, like, mentions this. Like, if you talk to anyone... Oh, I forgot about that as well. That is another little side quest. So now we have the police chasing after this car. And what we have to do is stop the car. Yeah, they actually do. You can actually hear their voice clips if you're not holding down the B button like I am. Apparently they're innocent. That's what they all say. Must have gone this way then. Yep. I found you. Don't turn! Oh god, they turned. Oops. Yeah, you can also shoot the police car, which is kind of hilarious. Apparently my bullets do not go far enough. Okay. I know which way you're going. Okay, so we beat him. So now the little the little serve bots come out and they drop a case. Got a trunk full of cash. Okay. So there's actually two things you can do here. You can talk to the inspector and give him the trunk full of cash. Or you can just leave. If you leave, you take the trunk full of cash and you get 200 grand. Uh, which obviously would be very nice. But I'm actually not going to do that. If you give it to him, you get 20 grand. So for the record, uh, that actually was um, a mistake. There actually was no robbery. What actually happened was they just withdrew a bunch of money so that they could do something with it. Um. Anyways. I think you can actually... There was a bank robbery somewhere recently? The only bank I know of is this one. Does that mean... A little while ago we had some kids in here who said they were going to start a restaurant, so they came to borrow some money. So obviously they weren't used to handling so much money. They were so nervous carrying that trunk. It was really cute. And then we shot them. That'll teach them to not be white while confronting the police.
I actually don't know if it just starts immediately or not. Yeah, it just... It, okay. So... If you do... If you do give the money back, uh, they end up building their restaurant, which is this building right here. Um, if you don't give the money back, this restaurant doesn't appear. There's nothing actually, like... It doesn't add anything. You don't get any extra items. You don't get any extra weapons. The best thing is... But it's just... It's kind of cool to have. I just like having it here. And it, it you know, it's a little like a little extra something. Anyways. Um there's apparently still one side quest I forgot about. So if we talked to this gentleman over here. He said his wife had gone for a walk. With that said, I don't remember where she is. But I'm pretty sure she went over this way. What do you say, bro? Uh, no, I did not feel that, Tremors. Sorry. Also, that was like two weeks ago since I last played, just saying. I don't know. I don't know why you're just feeling it now. Laser. I'm pretty sure Miss Pregnant Lady is over this way. Or not. What's up, unique NPC? Could have sworn she was over here. Maybe I crazy. Maybe I so cray cray. Who the hell is she? Swear to dog, man. Just want to help a pregnant lady. Where the hell else are you going to take a walk? The lake? You can't walk on a lake. That's crazy. Old lady, you're crazy. Oh, wait, there she is. Found ya. See if she gets better. Let's take her to the hospital, shall we? Dude, you're running into a wall. She's in room 305, along with the chick who just had a baby. Except for not. Come back. No. I won't come back. Just... So, since I completely forgot about this particular quest, I don't remember anything about it. I don't know if... Uh... Not sunlight. What? Okay. Um. Well, let's see what that's for. Because <laughs> honestly, I don't remember. What am I talking to you for? Broken circuits, main core shard, and sunlight were used to make the buster unit part of the unit Omega. Cool. Let's see what that gives. Two to everything except for rapid, which gets one. but I gained quite a bit of range with that. I 
I don't really think it matters. I'm not going to use any of this anyway. I have a laser, but, you know, just saying. Okay. So before we end off, end this part off, um, I'm pretty sure now if you go back to the Apple Market, um, that lady will actually be there with her kid. Don't quote me on that, though. Nope, they're not back yet. Okay, whatever. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end off this part. Uh, in the next part, we're actually going to go and um, finish the game. Um, as far as I know, I haven't missed anything, but I might have. I don't know. Uh, obviously, I missed that side quest and didn't even realize it. But other than that, I think I've done everything. This is what I get for having not played this game in, like, forever. Hmm. You can see outside the Apple Market by doing that. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, like I said, in the next part, we're going to be going down through the main gate, actually beating the game. There's not too, too much left to do. It's really just um, one last boss battle. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. This has been Pink Reaper signing out.